Hello. I wanted to make this video to talk about a couple things. As a lot of you guys are well aware with the uh, several uh, clips online featuring Shane Dawson, I wanted to take a moment to say that as somebody who is an older fan that it is it is okay to go and step away and no longer support Shane Dawson. And that I understand for many people like myself who have watched Shane Dawson from the beginning or last couple years, that it is okay to feel disgusted, to feel ashamed. And that it's, there really is no excuse for the videos. I know some people will try to say that, well, that was 10 years ago, not, I shouldn't be, you know, canceled for this, but the, the clip of Willow, of, the clip that features him doing a motion in front of a Willow Smith poster, I think it speaks volumes. Because one, it, there's really no way to explain that video. And both of them have, the Smith family has every right to not accept the apology. There's really no way to explain this. There's no way to defend him. And yes, I saw Shane Dawson's original video with the apologizing for blackface. And I, at the time, accepted it. What I didn't know was the other stuff that came out. Comments he made about Shauna. I myself did not listen to Shane Dawson's podcast. And while I definitely understand that there are things of edgy jokes, but to see how many jokes he made, they definitely cross many lines. It's to the point where I can't sit back and say, well, that was an edgy joke. There's nothing edgy about that joke. It just comes across as creepy. I think the reason why a lot of people are so shocked by this is that we tend to idolize Shane Dawson. We kind of put him on this pedestal of the golden boy of YouTube and how essentially he could do no wrong. He apologized. He's grown. He's changed. And now we're seeing his true side. And I think we saw the real Shane Dawson when it came to that four-page essay that he tweeted and then deleted and referenced in his video. I'm just going to say that it is okay to no longer support Shane Dawson. You can go and unfollow him on all of his social medias. You can no longer watch his videos, no longer buy his merch. I get it because that's what I plan on doing. I'm not going to enable that kind of behavior ever again. And it's also... As I think one of the most difficult things is to take a self reflection, self reflection on myself because I feel disgusted knowing that I support that kind of behavior. I feel, I feel ashamed for being so ignorant. The only thing I can do is show growth and change and do better. And I really do hope that if Shane Dawson is correct in that apology that he wants to change, I sure hope that he changes. I sure hope that he actually means what he says. I hope that he actually does something.